as of the late Sultan of Sulu, have asked the Dutch court for permission to seize Malaysian assets in the Netherlands, their lawyer said, seeking enforcement of a 15 billion US dollar arbitration award granted to them by a French arbitration court in February against Malaysia's government. According to a copy of the court petition shared by their lawyer, the heirs wish to take recourse against assets of Malaysia, which are located in the Netherlands. The filing in the Netherlands will soon be followed by other enforcement actions of varying types in multiple jurisdictions, which may include immediate, direct attachment of specific Malaysian assets in the Netherlands and elsewhere, lawyer Paul Cohen, a lead co-counsel for the Sultan's heirs from British law firm 45 Grays Inn Square, told Reuters in an emailed statement. The petition did not specify which assets. Some of Malaysia's biggest companies have operations in the Netherlands, including state oil firm Petronas and palm oil producer Saimdabi Plantations. The company said no immediate comment on the Dutch petition when contacted by Reuters. The dispute is over a deal signed in 1878 between two European colonists and the Sultan for use of his territory in present-day Malaysia, an agreement that independent Malaysia honoured until 2013 paying the monarch's descendants about US dollars a year. The Malaysian government stopped the payments after a bloody incursion by supporters of the former Sultanate who wanted to reclaim land from Malaysia. Their heirs went to an arbitration court over the suspension of payments. Malaysia did not participate in nor recognize the arbitration.